Thank you calls in wow, this uh, 1877 tell hln uh, joining me uh, rochelle tips us off the lawyers are in civil rights attorney av friedman is with us also uh, rejoining us defense attorney tamara holder all right uh tamara here's I'm, I'm not even this wasn't even a rant the way i understand it that this was part of like an invitation for somebody to come and spend the night and in the midst of that says hey who said sleeping in a moldy apartment was bad for you horizon realty thinks so so how is this a fifty thousand dollar libel lawsuit well, you know, I see it two sides of this. I see wow. that somebody is on Twitter and they're saying whatever they want. And so it's, you know, even though she has 17 followers, uh, if you can just kind of go with me on this, does it matter if somebody has one gram of cocaine versus a kilo? Oh, it's still a crime. So wow. the number of followers is irrelevant. It's the fact that she made a statement that this company says is false. Oh. Whether or not there are 17 followers, it doesn't matter. Now, I, I don't think that, I think that the statement was so vague that the reasonable person, and that is for the jury to decide yeah, eventually, right. oh. whether, whether this is defam defamation. All right, Avery, what do you think? Yeah, Does the big company have a case against no. poor Amanda Bonin or not? Not at all. It's not defamation. I don't even understand the analogy. The bottom line is it's not defamation. It, 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 is, not, it is protected speech. You want to know something?